should I be attending trade shows and industry events as a roofing contractor? Is it worth my time? Yeah, yeah I think so. Uh, I never did until last year. I went to my first one. I've been, which my business, the primary roofing business, really for me, you know, we did everything until about three years ago. So it's, you know, roofing was fairly new to me. And then last year I kind of learned about these events and the shows and stuff and went to a couple last year. And yeah, I think they're great. Um, I think the only problem is, is that you got to be careful how many thoughts you get in your head. So I, I think that there's guys out there that have all these experienced people talking in their ears and and giving them this great advice and it's great advice like it, it is great advice um hey you gotta go to bed hold on a second he was asleep like before i come down he was asleep he's definitely might be sleepwalking but um yeah so no you, but they get too many ideas in their head and then you're not able to execute on any of them so if you've got all these really good ideas and really good you know, opportunities to execute, but you don't have the time. So like for me, I think luckily I have, I have a significant amount of time so I can take on some a significant amount of ideas, take that time, put them into processes and execute them. But if you're, you know, still working on the job a lot, or if you're still, you know, in sales a lot, you don't have a ton of extra time. So let's find, go to one event a year, maybe in the off season. I, well, I, there's a couple in the off season, one down in Orlando. There's going to be one over IRE is going to be in Texas. What's the one in Orlando called? Uh, RoofCon. And then you've got, you got a couple, right? There's, there's a, there, 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 there th yeah, that one. There, there's three or four that I think are valuable. Um, but I'd find one good one. And then but maybe buy the more expensive ticket to where you can go sit through some of the, um, the keynote speakers and stuff, really get a good value out of the entire experience. And then take that back to your team or take your team with you and then try to execute on one event, you know, cause one event you can walk away with a lot of shit, you know, um, there's really not much sense in going to multiple events if you're not executing on the stuff you got from the first one. Yeah. Yeah. That makes sense. Sometimes less is more. You got to, you got to put it in, a, in into a process or it was a waste of time. And what yeah. could you have done with that time if you would just stayed home? So, yeah. um, you know, that's just kind of the way I look at it. Yeah. That makes sense. All right, let's do one more question and we'll wrap up. We'll keep it, keep it simple. Staples or coil nails for underlayment? Or it's, uh, it's not, it's button heads, right? Staples or button heads? 